Alrighty guys, I just want to do a quick video for my friend uh, Matt. He is an excellent craftsman. He is doing a lot of projects right now. He's building cabinets, but he also does a lot of other small stuff. And he did these beautifully made cutting boards. Now this is end grain, and these things are absolutely gorgeous. Now these are all individual pieces. This one row has 10 pieces. I thank you Matt so much for uh, for giving me a few. But uh, Ninja's my friend, go check him out, go watch him. Uh, go watch his uh, video game streams. I'll tell you this, based on what I have to do, uh, I really don't have time to play video games anymore. So I, I thought it was crazy that people were actually streaming video games and that it's even crazier that people were actually watching them. I was watching Ninja for a while, I actually understood why people actually watch people play video games. You know, it's very entertaining and you get the satisfaction of being involved with the game without actually playing it because sometimes I just want to lay on the couch and do nothing and even playing video games it would be too much work you know it, it's, it's rare it's once in a great blue moon that I actually get to do that but but yeah but when I do I do watch Ninja I personally know him he is my friend so please go check him out go subscribe to him along with his wife Jessica Blevins I watch them both they are actually the only uh, twitch streamers that I watch I love all you guys I love you Justin Ty if you guys if you guys end up watching this and so it's good but all right guys so today is the three year anniversary of this channel now what I want to do today is I it's not going to get many views it's not going to be popular but it's going to be for the people who actually care I'll show you the difference of the house from when I first bought this house and uploaded the very first episode to now. We're going to go through it, not in total detail, but you guys are going to completely see the difference between then and now. It's great. I love the way that the house is turning out. It's almost done. So let's just get to it. Let's go around the house and go around the yard and I'll show you guys what the difference is. The past couple of months that I haven't been able to do yet since I've been living here is take my skateboard down to the river. I figured this would be a good time to do that. Hi, puppy. You're not even... There you go. There you are. Hi. Relax, puppy. I know. I know. And we have a lot of things to do still. This is the kitchen. We painted the cabinets. These were stained as well. They're ugly. We uh, got a new uh, we got a new stove top. We got new counters. I still have to caulk this seam right here. Some genius put the knobs on wrong or the doors on backwards. All right, so as you guys can see here, the kitchen is completely up to date. We still have some miscellaneous things to do. Got the backsplash on there on two walls. It turned out nice. Turned out very nice. Got. We still need to decorate. We still need to add the little trinkets. The laundry room. Yeah, the last time the person put the doors on backwards. Our old washer and dryer went out, so we had to get two new ones. And so it was during the same process, but it looks good though. It looks good. But after a lot of work, it looks like it's everything's gonna look like that. Here is the, the dining area. We still need to get a good table for this area. Here is the fireplace. Got the hearth and the mantle done. Yeah, it looks a, looks a lot better. The living room, TV still in the same spot. Yeah, all together it is, the house is coming along. I know, Pop, you're just staring at me. Grab these. And this is our screen and porch, which is awesome. We have big plans for this. So let's go to the screen and porch. And yeah, the last of the, now this used to be our garbage area from when we first moved in here because we had a lot of stuff that we needed to throw away that we ripped up, ripped out. But yeah, now this is, an, this has been for a long time, a functional screen and porch. So this is good. There are plans over here. We have this stuff right here because we have a little leak that happens at that corner when it rains. So we got to figure that we got to figure that out. So into the garage. This is a single car garage, but it is extremely long. It'd be my future tool area. 
And uh, right now, unfortunately, I got my uh, Halo Halo suit just sitting there collecting dust. But yes, but as you guys know, you guys see many videos. Like I said in the very first video, this garage is going to be my man cave. And that's exactly what I turned it into. And so, yeah, it's good. And like I said, like I said in a previous video, I am going to take down this siding on this wall. Uh, Ryobi Link, the Ryobi Link system is going to be on this wall. And yeah, so I'm tired of how this is. I always have some sort of garden gardening tool just laying around, which I want everything organized on this wall, including stuff that I would, normally wouldn't put up here. But, but because of the Link system, I'll be able to put it on the wall, which... I'm excited about that. This is the this is the backyard. And it's awesome. We got a little side yard. When it comes to the deck, the deck's been power washed many times, and so it is now a deck that we don't flip on. It's been like that for the past few years. I have the vanity and the toilet right here from the the old toilet from the bathroom. So yeah, when it comes to the yard, got it the winterized wave wave runner right there. When it comes to the yard, we put we put so much time and effort into the yard for the past couple of years. I'll show you guys pictures right now, but that used to be all weeds that are grown to like eight feet high. Uh, it's fall right now, so this isn't like blooming with colors. It's so covered up with leaves. But yeah, this is the garden, little garden area. Now, this fall, I am going to take out the dead bushes. I got uh, permission from my neighbor. So I got one, two, three, four, five, five bushes to take out. As you can see, like it's gonna, it's gonna change the way it, uh, both yards look together. Stuff like that. Yeah, but there used to be patches everywhere. Those patches are now gone. Like I said, for the past couple of years, we've, we've been working on everything for the house and it is, it's almost done. It is almost done. And this is the front of the yard. And the front yard, the same thing. There was patches everywhere when we first moved in, but now it is looking good. This is my wife's front, uh, my wife's front garden. Like, like I said, uh, just like the backyard during the summer, this is very colorful, but it's fall right now, so it looks a little bland. But yeah, this changes the, changed the way that the front looked. All this was, was rocks. Rocks and clay with some uh, bushes in it. Those bushes are gone. Oh, I can turn that off since I'm doing the vlog really quick. Take, just taking a little break. It comes to my wife's office. The office is complete. It's a little bit more decorating if she wants to. But yeah, she's been using this. Uh, she's been working from home for the past almost two years, a uh, year and a half, but she does still go, to, go into work, but she does work from home. So yeah, this is the office. Turn the light on. Still gotta replace that fan if we want to. We really don't use it. All right, this is what I am working on today. I put a couple of planks in. Uh, I, uh, I'm just gonna finish this room with the floor. Then after I go to that wall, do the closet, and then I'm gonna start painting this room. Here is the master bedroom. I know, meow meow, I know. You like a girl? You like a girl? I know. But yeah, the master bedroom, uh, we're still tr trying to figure out what we're gonna do for the closet doors. If we want like a farm style door or two doors that slide into each other, we're still figuring that out. But yeah, the it's looking better. This house came a long way. This is our bedroom situation, it sucks. This is our bedroom situation. I have this much for the past long time, this much space to go to my bed. There's my meow meow. Hi meow meow. The game room, I'm still working on the game room because like I said, I'm gonna turn this into an office because I do not want, I don't use the game room anymore or we don't use this anymore. Like that TV hasn't been turned on in probably two years. So yeah, it's time to turn this into a functional room. Stop eating the stuff. 
I know, puppy. I know. I know. The bathroom is still underway. I need to do the trim, installing the stuff. I made some uh, scratch, uh, scuffed up the paint, and I got to patch that. Put the trim back up. I fixed the drywall right there. I need to replace that. But yeah, but the bathroom is looking better. You guys saw the difference, and I just want to let you guys know that this would not even be possible for me to accomplish these goals and do this channel if it wasn't for you guys. I appreciate every view that I get, and I seriously love it. I seriously love you guys. You guys are you guys seriously help support the channel. So I seriously appreciate everything you guys have done uh, for this channel and for me. Like, there isn't enough words to thank you guys. I seriously love you guys. I thank every single one of you guys for uh, showing your support towards the channel in any way possible. If it's a like, a comment, a view, anything. You know, just uh, I seriously appreciate everything but like i said back when i was in construction this was the tools everyone was using you know like this type of tool not just a dewalt but yeah back when i was in new construction it was like this so when i first bought this house uh i had no clue what brushless motors were i have no clue i was totally out of the loop because once once the market crashed i started working into people's actual houses that they lived in I did that for about a year and I'm like, I'm done. You know, like I can, I was so used to working on, on a construction site where you could do whatever you want. You could be loud, you know, you didn't have to worry about people's privacy. And so I was spoiled with that. So as soon as I started to actually work, uh, was sort of forced to work in people's houses, I quit construction just because I couldn't do that anymore. I couldn't work in someone's house while, you know, installing a floor while people are sleeping you know i i can't do that i can't this was the three year anniversary and i am proud of what i was able to accomplish with your guys help this none of this would have happened uh without you guys life is more satisfactory to me knowing that i'm doing this channel with you guys this is awesome i love you guys and so yeah so that's pretty much it more videos coming up i have a ton of more videos coming up along with my personal best uh with my opinion with my opinion i think that this is the best tool sale at home depot right now i'll be doing a video on this very soon along with the dewalt jigsaw so yeah so that's pretty much it you guys i thank all you guys one more time for helping support this channel but that's pretty much it i hope you found this video helpful and entertaining please like this video please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos and please subscribe to the channel this is dave nicholas thank you for tuning in i'll see you guys next time